Hi, my name is Stacy Brody. I'm entering my third year of undergraduate studies at Rutgers University in New Brunswick, New Jersey. Um, I did my poster on malarial curatives from the Northeastern United States, and my co-authors are Rocky Grazios, Ilya Raskin, and Lena Struve. Uh, the work was conducted in Ilya Raskin's lab in New Brunswick, and also in Cape Town in, in South Africa. I focused on Native American ethnobotany and North American ethnobotany in general. Uh, we looked at which plants were used to treat malaria. I reviewed the literature and selected five plants to test. These were Alnus serrata, Calicarpa dicotoma, Cercis canadensis, Eupatorium perfoliatum, and Quercus alba. These were commonly mentioned in the literature. Um, we did a stepwise extraction method and came up with four extracts per plant and we sent these extracts over to the University of Cape Town in South Africa where they tested them against the malaria parasite. The chloroform extracts for all the plants were active and this was to be expected as the method was designed to isolate alkaloids in these extracts. So that wasn't as surprising. Uh, what did surprise me was the activity of the aqueous extract of the beauty berry or the Calicarpa dicotoma fruit. Um, it was pretty active and I suspect this may be due to the to the presence of glycosides which would have come out in this extract. Um, these are fairly active compounds. They have been extracted from other plants in this genus and even from with this species. So I'd like to take my work further and to do that. Um, I'd like to thank you for your time and if you have any questions feel free to contact. You can find me at Rutgers University.